Dr. Jay's wife with Family First Chiropractic's weekly wellness video. The theme this month is Halloween. It's right around the corner. It's a really fun time of year. We're going to be showing you several healthy recipes this month. Jonathan's asked me to show you one of our family's favorite, which is healthy candy bars. So uh, there's a lot of really great stuff in them and they taste fantastic. So uh, with that being said, let's get started. As you can go right there. Thank you. Okay, so what we start with is a cup and a half of cashews. We use raw organic cashews, and uh, you wanna really bring it to a fine meal. So I've already kind of gotten started. All right, awesome. Actually, it needs one. And then from there, we're gonna add one and a half cups of dates. I've already cut these. Uh, they do need to be pitted, so um, just keep that in mind. It takes a, you know, this is probably the longest part of the process is getting these dates pitted and cut up. So, might want to plan ahead. Hi, sweet. You want to press this button for a moment? Come here. sweetness to it with being um, really healthy and not having to add any processed sugars or anything like that. So from there we're going to do a half a cup of almond butter. We like to use an organic almond butter, um, but you know, whatever you've got lying around. We happen to have a lot of these things all the time in the house. <laughs> just as yummy. So I like to actually process these in between each thing that I put in, each ingredient that I put in. I've found it easier and I've been making them for years. the coconut oil and the vanilla. We added a little bit extra coconut oil, we like that. So I'm just gonna go ahead and take it out of the food processor. And all we do from here is, Hudson, you can help mommy. You can stick your hands in here. We just press it out into a pan with parchment paper and um, we're gonna put it in the fridge or freezer for about six to eight hours. And then uh, we'll catch back up with you and finish out the candy bars. Okay, so our bars have been in the freezer for a couple of hours now, and what I've done is uh, gone ahead and used a double boiler to uh, melt some 70% cacao, and I'm going to pour it on top of our bars, and then they're going to go back in to the freezer, and then we're going to cut them into fun Halloween shapes. Okay, don't put that in there, buddy. Watch mommy, you can use mommy's. Okay, now help mommy with this. Yeah, use this one. There you go. Yeah, you ready? Oh, wow. Okay, you gonna do it? Yeah. 
Hey guys, so we're running out of time here. What I've done is I've gone ahead and taken the pan out of the freezer, taken the parchment paper out, sat it on the counter, and I'm letting it come to room temperature, and then I'm gonna cut out some fun little Halloween shapes for the candy bars. Um, anything that's left over, I'm gonna cut up, and you can cut up um, into little bite-sized pieces and put them in the freezer. They're wonderful for nights that you just need something sweet and you wanna have it healthy. You don't want cookies and sugary and uh, ice cream. They're perfect for uh, to quench that, that sugar that you're needing. So anyways, I hope you guys really enjoy this. Uh, it's our family's favorite, and happy Halloween.